everyone, I'm Zinnia, and I'm going to show you a tutorial on how to use Aves Epoxy Modeling Compound. What I'm going to do is I'm going to teach you how to use this two-part epoxy, and what we're going to do with it, we're going to make some really exciting tops for your bottles that will be permanent and will stay on there forever. So if you want to put something in your bottles to begin with, you'll want to do that to start with, because once you get your bottle top all looking beautiful like this and sculpted, it's not going to go anywhere, I can promise you that. The bottle will break before the top will break. So get ready, get your supplies together, and we will have some fun. Today we're going to do some really fun things using Aves Epoxy Sculpt. When I use this product, one of my favorite things to do with it is to create a bottle top that will stay secure in, and actually permanently bond to the bottle that I'm making. There's going to be a couple of ways that you can create the artwork at the top of the bottle, which would include just kind of plopping something down on top of the mouth of the bottle and using the epoxy to adhere to it. But more than that, I want to show you some ways to actually sculpt it in and really make it look like a natural part of how the bottle is transforming from glass into whatever it is that you're putting on top of your bottle. For this tutorial I'm going to show you how to use the coral, how to do a finial, and also how to do these rock crystals. So when we come back you'll want to have collected up some old bottles and any of these neat little things that you can find. Maybe you have some around the house already or in your stash and we're going to make some really fun things. <music> 